Hello human peoples. <laughs> As you can tell, I regret putting that Japanese beetle um, inside of the place. As you can tell. I, I, I regret putting it with the other Japanese beetle. Because when two Japanese beetles go, get together, um, nothing good happens, okay? Like, the two days long piece of the previous Japanese beetle has been quickly ruined. And by the way, currently they're still fighting with each other. They're, they're still like, in the loop of walking but walking on each other and the, which means like non-stop walking because they're so dumb okay that stings on actually but yeah um, look at these mosquitoes they're still doing really well look at oh my god it's still smelling actually it doesn't smell that bad it smells like what i ate for dinner to be honest like oh my god okay one Two, three, four. Very amazing. So yeah, time to get more of these guys. Okay, human beings. I'm going to let some more water in because um, they're going to use that flower petal as a platform, and um, I was going to have to remove that flower petal because, well, um, I don't want them to use it as a platform. So and I want to just be pure Japanese beetles inside of there. So yeah, but <clears throat> it's gonna be pretty hard to do that because, well, I'm not sticking my fingers inside of there for obvious reasons because it smells like someone had like diarrhea there for like two days straight, and it's still not stopping right now. And two, um, there's so many Japanese beetles, I just don't want them to get to escape through my fingers because that that, that is just nasty and bad. So yeah, I'm gonna have to use, use like a chopstick system to get it out. No, or, or I could just stab it out. Yeah, stab it, stabbing it out would be pretty good. I can do that with, I don't know. This thing, this thing always helps. So yeah, hopefully they are not gonna try to fly this time. Oh my God, look at that, that, that is so brutal. Okay, just bear the stench. Try to bear the stench. Oh my god. Okay, that flower petal is out. Oh my god, I just touched the water. Okay, this one. Oh my god. This one's out. This. This. Oh my god. This one's out. Stir the soup, you know. Casually stir the soup. That one's still alive. Get back inside. Don't want any flower petals inside of here. It won't be pure Japanese beetles. Because at the end of at the end of the Japanese beetle season, I'm going to make like a soup. I'm going to make a Japanese beetle beetle juice, you know, like. Beetlejuice. Okay. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna do that by like crushing all of them, and turning it into a paste, extracting just the juice. Oh my god! Some of these men are still alive, and they're, they're, they're not using this per this chance that I'm giving them to just open their elytras and fly away as fast as possible. Like they're so dumb. Oh my god. That was our last chance. Getting that is subtraction. These beetles are the embodiment of if you can get from point A to point B and reproduce, then you're a successful species because that is what they are. I'm not even kidding. Like the only time when they show any knowledge that there's another Japanese beetle in front of it is when they're reproducing. All the other times, like here's what happens. Also, why is this camera so shaky? But yeah, like. Just a casual walking around, you know. Definitely not walking top of a bunch of corpses. My same species. Possibly my whole entire family tree. But yeah, anyways, um, I added more water so that they have a little bit more space to go swimming. That's it. But like, th that's only if they can get through this three-layer thick pile of corpses floating at the top. 
And there's also a bunch of corpses at the bottom. What a gruesome scene to look at. But yeah, anyways, um, see you next video and bye.